Hello and welcome to the Oakville Milton and District Real Estate Board video tutorial series. Today we will be talking about the Market Watch widget. Our topics for today's video are going to be what is the Market Watch widget and what is it used for, how to use the Market Watch widget and get the most out of it, as well as how to customize the Market Watch widget so that it shows information more relevant to what you are looking for. First off, what is the Market Watch widget? The Market Watch widget is a quick snapshot of all changes on the MLS system, broken down by change type. You can set it by property and customize it to be more relevant to what you're looking for, as well as expand on how far back it looks. The Market Watch widget is located on the front page of Matrix. To use it, Click on any one of the change types to be taken to a list of those change types. If you would like to change the type of property the Market Watch is looking for, click on the Property drop-down box, and this will allow you to change it between residential, vacant land, and industrial commercial, or across property, which will search all property types. You can also change the time frame that the Market Watch is looking for by using the Time drop-down box either 24 hours, which will be anything that's changed in the last 24 hours, today, which will be anything that has changed within the midnight to midnight period of the current day, and three days and seven days, which will show changes from that far in the past. By default, the Market Watch widget will show all changes on the board within the property type selected. This can be changed by clicking on the Customize link. This will take you to a screen where you can set the criteria for which the Market Watch is going to display results. It can be as narrow as a single house to as broad as the entire board. After you've set your criteria, click Save, and this will return you to the home screen and will now display a Market Watch using the criteria that you have selected. If you need to reset it back to the default, click on the Reset link. This will return the Market Watch to its default properties of showing all listings on the Oakville Milton board. I hope you enjoyed this video in the Oakville Milton and District Real Estate Board video tutorial series. Now for a quick lesson recap. First, we learned how to use the Market Watch widget. Click on the change type if you wish to see a display of all of the changes within that type. You can use the property drop-down menu to select the different property types and alter what the market watch displays when you click on one of the change types. You can use the time box drop-down menu to select the time period of which the market watch will display changes. We then learned how to customize the market watch. First, you click on the customize link, which will take you to the criteria screen, where you can set the criteria for your market watch to display. After your criteria has been set, click the Save button, which will return you to the home page, showing a market watch now displaying changes within the criteria setup. Finally, you can click on the Reset link to return the market watch to its default values. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any further questions, please contact the Oakville Milton and District Real Estate Board Support Services at 905-844-6491.